Welcome to another Driving in MacArthur. Today we have someone I've been looking forward to driving with for a long time, Yusefi. Hello Yusuf. how are you going? How's this going? I'm good, yourself? Fantabulously fantastic. So, first of all, how do you pronounce your full name? Uh, Yusuf El Ghul. See, I, could, I thought it could have been El Ghul. <laughs> I mean, if you're my dad, probably El Ghul. <laughs> <laughs> well, you think I'm as old as your dad? No, that's Michael. <laughs> That's my. Don't get me started. Okay. Uh, um, so, a little bit about you. You work for us in our finance department. Correct. How long have you been working with Wakelands for? Uh, one year and one month. And as a result of being sort of around that 12 month mark recently, you were acknowledged in the Point Promo Group as the Rookie of the Year. Now, when you got nominated, congratulations by Thank the way, you. When, when you got nominated for Rookie of the Year and, and we had our COVID safe awards night, mm -hmm. I did notice, because you knew you were nominated, I mm. did notice <laughs> that um, you were dressed slightly differently and you were made up a little bit differently to normal. You had a fresh haircut. Yes. You had your eyebrows waxed. That's it. Thank you. Your moustache. We're going to get to Carly later. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you had your moustache trimmed. That's it. And then today, what happens? Um, I get told that I'm going in the car with the spot um, and I'm going to be filmed. I haven't had a haircut. It was booked for tomorrow. Um, my eyebrows look shocking. I think I've got a third one coming along. <laughs> um, yeah, definitely not, not ready. Not ready. So we're going to apologise to everyone at home watching this, you know, for the like. Yeah, of, definitely. So like this is my bad of, side. Is, um, yes. <laughs> <laughs> that's the funny thing, you know, which, which, which says, oh my, you're a person that knows you have a bad side. Oh, definitely. And like most people would just say their whole side's a bad side. Um, you've got a, a specific face. side, which is bad. Why is that side particularly bad? Um, I think it's where most of the hair loss is happening, so you've got a little bit of receding hairline. Right, right. A little bit of fuzz on the side. Okay. It's just uneven. Yeah. yeah. So you're a man that likes to look after himself. That's very good. And Carly helps with that a lot. Sorry, definitely. your partner Carly? Yep, so she's a beautician, so I might get all the extras with that. And what's her business called? Um, Browse by Carly. Nice. Uh, I've seen a photo on her Facebook page of you freshly done. I'm assuming oh, I know. it was you. <laughs> yeah. So if you want to go to Facebook and yeah. go to Browse by Carly, <laughs> <laughs> you'll find a photo of my <laughs> Before and after? I can't remember. Uh, I just yeah, remember looking I, at the after. I think it was a before. <laughs> you can tell it's me from the before. Do you reckon she'd be able to help me with my eyebrows? Apparently, you can't see mine. Uh. So. Um, <laughs> I've been told I could maybe get them coloured or something. Yeah, you can get them tinted. Yeah, um, yeah. yeah definitely. They'll, yeah. they'll show a little more. They'll pop. Um, part, part of being a very pale skinned person is that <laughs> being called Albie at school, you know. Oh, yeah. Is that I'm told I don't have any eyebrows, but they are there. Okay, fair enough. You can't miss yours. <laughs> Caterpillars. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, came to Wakelands just over a year ago. That's right. You came from ANZ Bank. So tell us a bit about you growing up and your aspirations and I hear oh, you were a bit of a, bit ping of a pong. nerd for yeah. a while. Oh hell yeah. Still are yeah. a bit of a nerd? Yeah, well definitely. Yeah. Um, yeah, I had a little show and tell you so at work. Brought my new Game Boy little thing yeah. to work to show everyone. I've always been a little bit of a geek um, and a whiz at school. I used to love maths and physics. I went into uni with high aspirations. I um, wanted to do medical radiation physics. I think you dabbled in that. Well, I'm a graduate of You're a graduate, physics. so you actually yeah, yeah. finished the course. Yeah. <laughs> Um, I lasted about two years, moved to, had a gap year, went to business in um, Western Sydney, lasted about a month until I realised I could boring, and dropped out. Yeah. Um, started working at ANZ, um, prior to ANZ I was working from year 10 to business, uh, to, to this job at um, the cafe, Michelle's Tissue at Macarthur Square. Barista. As a barista, correct, yeah. so that's yeah. about 10 years. Then when I started working at ANZ, I was still working at the cafe. I was actually working three jobs at the time for a year. Yeah. Um, I was a pizza delivery person. Yeah. Um, I was a barista and I was at ANZ as a um, banking consultant um, for a year. So you're a man that can juggle lots of things at any one point in time. Oh, part, yeah. part of your attention disorder sort of stuff. Yeah, definitely. I can't sit still. I yeah. just have to do something. Um, yeah. yeah. So what have you liked about um, what you do with us? Just the ability to control my success, mm -hmm. um, as opposed to knowing all that I can do with another job and not really having much give on what I earn and what I can do. Mm -hmm. um, also, it's a challenge every day, something different every day. Yep. Um, it's never the same thing, you've got multiple products to work on, so yep. just never doing the same thing every day. And, it's definitely yep. a big and, I, and I would think one of the things that comes across is that you, whilst you're a big kid, <laughs> you're also a bit of a people person. Definitely. And you like to please. Definitely. 
in addition to being a bit of a geek, mm. you also like food, right? Oh. We've spoken a few times about food. And when I get stuff from, well, you got the Susie Dukes stuff? That really yeah, cool. yeah, that's right, it was nice. Uh, the other day when I got some donuts, you stole them. I mean, I um, I was offered it and I declined <laughs> it, and then after an hour it was still there. So I took up standing, the opportunity. Standing offer. Yeah, yeah, that's right. And the other day, uh, in fact, with Jade, mm. we were having a bite to eat, and we'd been to a new cafe restaurant. Fuck that one. Yeah, fuck that one. Yeah, so you and to, uh, you missed out because yeah. it was what was it called? Big, uh, Big Fat, Fat Greek. Big Fat Greek. Had a conversation with Jade that morning about it, and I'm sure oh, did you? <laughs> I didn't know. I was that. surprised to see that I wasn't involved. Um, <laughs> but it's okay. Um, I'm yet to try it. I, I will one day. Well, I thought, well, better time to try it Ooh. now. So you might have noticed we're circling <laughs> Woodbine. Yeah, yeah. I was like, okay, where are we going? We're going down the hill. I'm just had to time up just right to go. Look, here's the big fat Greek. <laughs> Good timing. <laughs> so. Um, you know, I mean, you're not Greek, no, but you're right. Mediterranean kind of Yeah, place. basically, so I'm still Greek, yeah. sea oily, hairy. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I figured, you know, <laughs> you'd be able to, you'd know the lay of the land. Yeah. Oh, when <laughs> I went in with Jade the other day, married to Theo, who's Greek, yeah. she knew how to pronounce what we were ordering. I think gyros, but I'm well, oh, I was... Just... I said, can I have a gyros? I, was, I said gyros, she's like, gyros? Well, she gyros looked at me. Yeah. <laughs> you can't say it like that. Yeah. <laughs> So, yeah, one of the things we were talking about, mm. um, it's quite dangerous working in the motor industry because you end up, you said you put some weight on pretty much instantly, yeah. instantaneously because yeah. we eat really healthy. Well, yeah, mm. it, it's also got to do with how easy it is persuade, to persuade me to just yeah. eat takeaway. And it's all within walking distance, which well, is... Uh, not that you walk. Have you ever walked there? Uh, no, hell no. No, right. No. And so, so I know how hard it was to get you today by going, hey, there's big fat group. Yeah. Yeah, oh, right. <laughs> Second you mention it. <laughs> you didn't have a choice, but it's cool. Yeah, true. Um, <laughs> so, looking forward to that, but yeah. I, I want to go back and explore a bit of your geekness, because mm. it's intriguing. Okay. Hobbies, Toys. Lego. Um, Lego. I'm obsessed with Lego, I'm obsessed with, um, anyone still remembers, Meccano. Um, oh, Meccano, yeah, I remember Meccano. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Obsessed with those kind of things. Um, I'm absolutely obsessed with something called Zoids. Well, we're nearly back home. And the day's not over because we're now going to go and eat our Giros, oh, Gyros, Giros, uh, yeah, any one of the combinations <laughs> of the above. Um, we didn't get any clarity, by the way. From That's okay, breaks. we'll call Theo. <laughs> yeah, we'll know. Yeah. Theo knows most of those things. Yeah. We could do a brewster off with Theo, too. Really? He's a brewster. Nah. Yeah, Michael's a brewster. Old really? man. Old man. Oh, but then. Yeah, no, no. What's that? Oh, I'm the pro. No, they, oh. <laughs> that was a kiosk, this was a cafe. Ah, yes, yes. No, I'm kidding. So if we don't get to have proper departure and farewell, thanks for what we're going to do next. It's going to be really cool. Mm -hmm. Thanks for spending some time with us. No, thank you. It was a pleasure. I think we'll have a farewell in the boardroom where we consume our... Um, food? Food. Nice. And we'll yeah, yeah. make Jade jealous. Yes. Because I think we should get an audience. <laughs> <laughs> One of the things you mentioned was Lego. So I thought, as well as having lunch, <laughs> we could look at... Uh, some Lego stuff. Ooh. Now what I did was, here's stuff that I've built earlier. Oh, I was going to say And I thought that. this one might be the most suitable one for you to show us your prowess. Alright. But we'll do that after lunch. It's a bit of a skillful thing. Yeah. Let's do lunch. <laughs> what do you reckon? Hmm? <laughs> I'm busy, man. <laughs> it's very good. Mm -hmm. You are a Lego genius self-proclaimed. Oh, I'm not genius. So, um, I thought challenge for you would be, we'll give you a minute mm. to build a <laughs> Duplo from now. <laughs> this is torture. <laughs> oh, timer. Oh no. I think you've mucked it up, yes. <laughs> <laughs> well done. This one's to take home to rain so you can spend oh, time on a proper one. Thank you. Um, thanks very much for having some fun with us today. It was a pleasure. I've looked forward to it for a long time. <laughs>